The Winchester Public Library is set to reopen in about an hour. A young woman was brutally murdered there over the weekend. It will be a difficult day for people in Winchester after the shocking murder there over the weekend. Today, community members turned out to remember the victim. WBZ's Anna Myler reports now from Winchester. The Winchester Public Library will open its doors in an hour from now for the first time since a 22-year-old woman was viciously attacked inside on Saturday. The library director says there will be a police presence here today to help the community feel safe. A memorial of flowers, photos, and mementos sits on the lawn outside the Winchester Public Library, paying tribute to 22-year-old Deanne Stryker, who was murdered inside the normally quiet and safe building on Saturday. Officials say Stryker, a medical student, was sitting in a reading room studying when 23-year-old Jeffrey Yao approached her from behind and attacked her with a hunting knife. 77-year-old Lester Tabor, who was reading a newspaper nearby, was also stabbed when he tried to intervene. This morning, the library director praised his actions. He was absolutely heroic. For him to step in um, in an instant when so many people um, are, are, are frozen, you know, you don't understand what's happening at the moment. And he, he stepped in. What a man. What a man. Community members came by this morning and drew hearts on the sidewalk with chalk as a way to spread love during this difficult time. Grief counselors will be on hand here for both the staff and the public. Reporting from Winchester, Anna Myler, WBZ News.